Um, I'm Jo Downs. We're at my workshop, studio, gallery in Launceston in Cornwall. Uh, we make glass fused products for interior spaces and for giftware uh, and anything from church windows to um, cruise liners, done ceilings on cruise liners, done installations in hotels, in all sorts of places. Um, the process is a kind of modern form of stained glass, I guess. So uh, there are lots of things about it that lend itself to stained glass. Um, it's pretty much without lead and everything's melted together. Uh, and it's got lots of textures and stuff, so. So I came to Cornwall every holiday possible when I was a child because my gran lived here and she lived on the coast uh, with a beautiful view of Tintagel uh, overlooking the sea there. So we used to come all the time and when I had a choice to decide where I wanted to be and where I wanted to work, um, it kind of felt like the natural thing. So I did love coming here, so it was like one of those favourites. But um, from an artistic point of view, it works perfectly, but that wasn't the reason for my choice. I just loved it here. So I did um, ceramics at GCSE level and with a guy called Mr Clay and uh, he kind of pushed me in that direction. He sort of said, you're really, really talented at this sort of thing. He said, I think you should do ceramics. So off I went, I did, a, a, I did my A-level art design, um, went on to do a foundation course because back then you needed to do a foundation course to do a, de a degree in something um, artistic. And while I was on my foundation course, my tutor said to me, he said, I know that you really, really want to do ceramics because you're completely like geared in that direction and that's all you kind of look at and that's all you want to do. He said, but have you ever thought about doing glass? Because everything you do for me says glass. It's like colorful, it's textured. And I kind of looked at him and went, mm, not, nah, not really. Anyway, I found a course that did both ceramics and glass um, and kind of thought, well, I can go and do it and then carry on doing the ceramics. So we could do a little bit of both. And the moment I started working with glass in this process, that was it, I was absolutely hooked. So I put a few bits of glass into a kiln. Uh, no one was doing this process at the time. So uh, like they weren't teaching it. They didn't have glass kilns for it. They just had kind of a random kiln. I went just, a visiting lecturer said, you can just put glass in a kiln and have a little go. So I did. And this amazing blob came out with all this texture and everything. And I went, oh my God, that's what I love. And that's what I want to do. So that was it. On that very day, I remember it going, oh, I know what I want to do with the rest of my life. And that was how I started. <laughs> wow, that's a question. I don't look that far ahead. <laughs> I think, I kind of think I'd love to be able to, you know, in the situation we are at the moment, which is great, uh, you know, it's always challenging. So even now, you know, we've got the rising energy prices, we've got the rising this ever since Brexit, you know, and then we've had COVID and then we've had the war and then we've got the situation now with the uh, you know everything increasing you know one of the challenges is actually making the business as it stands sustainable um, that's not that easy bearing in mind that we use electric kilns uh, everything that we buy has gone up massively in the last five years so trying to uh, still continue to create beautiful products that are affordable um, and um, people want to buy um, is kind of the challenge really so looking forward you know making it as sustainable as possible um, but just working on new and interesting projects which are always happening we're always being uh, uh, approached so you know I've got a project that I'm working on this year actually um, again that has, has come up um, and those are the things that are quite exciting. So it's kind of doing the smaller pieces, but also doing the bigger pieces, which is quite nice. 